The Slinky is one of my favorite demonstration tools to help students visualize longitudinal wave motion in an elastic mechanical medium. If you lay the Slinky on a smooth horizontal surface without too much friction, you can send wave pulses traveling down the Slinky that are easily visible to an audience of students. Using a high-speed camera allows us to capture the longitudinal wave pulses as they travel down the length of the slinky. The high-speed camera also helps us discover a couple of interesting things about wave propagation on the slinky. The speed of the wave depends on the number of coils the slinky has. The more coils, the slower the wave speed. In this split screen, both slinkies are stretched to the same length, but the slinky on top has one-third fewer coils than the slinky on the bottom. In the bottom slinky, which has more coils, the wave pulses travel slower. The time it takes a pulse to travel from one end of the slinky to the other is a constant, independent of how far the slinky is stretched. Stretching the slinky increases the stiffness, but decreases the mass density such that the wave speed is linearly proportional to the stretched length. Stretching the slinky further causes the wave to travel faster, but the time for the wave to travel from one end to the other remains constant for a given slinky. <laughs> 